everybody, welcome back to Coffee with the Moms. It's Nicole today, and today I have my second part of my Dollar Tree haul because I had so much stuff and I just felt so bad. I didn't want to make you guys sit through all of it in once. So this is my second bag, my second Toy Story bag. This one is super cute. I was so excited when I found this. I told you that last time. I'm super excited. So was my son. So um, yeah, we'll get right into this video because I kind of already explained it in the last one. So we went. I went to the dollar store with my son and he saw these. I mean, they're just little, you know, pinwheels to put outside. He was so excited. I mean, he just he held it the whole time so I picked it up it's really pretty I like it a lot um, I don't mind I'll put it outside so very cute kind of um, doesn't really go with the butterflies that I bought but he likes it so maybe I'll put it out back where all his play stuff is all right and then look at this cute little bag with all the watermelons and the pineapples I thought this was really cute for a dollar I like the material of it too it's like that hard like plasticky but like easy to like clean if you spill something on it or if something gets spilled because I'll probably be using this for like groceries and stuff so like you know I buy some stuff sometimes it's open um like there was one time I bought well I buy pickles all the time um uh, my husband and son both really love pickles so I buy the huge thing of it and it like must have tipped over when I was driving and there's pickle juice in the back of my car Ugh. so I mean I like pickles but like I don't want to smell pickle juice in my car. So that was annoying. So now what I do is just so bad at the grocery store. Please don't be angry. I will like pick it up and I just like tip it upside down real quick to make sure none of the juice is coming out because uh, the seal was broken on it. So yeah, so I'll be using these for um, groceries. So like it'll be easy to clean it up if I need to. And then these are, so these are little snack um, containers, which honestly, these are really small for snack containers. My son eats a lot more than this, but I'm actually, I bought these, um, because I'm going to be using them for like more of the diamonds from the diamond paintings that I do. Um, because I have some diamond paintings that are really big and they take me a while and sometimes I get sick of looking at them. So what I'll do is I will like start a smaller one and get that done too. So even though I have all those other little containers I got from the dollar store, these are just for like small ones. So there's there's 10 in here. So like these are for like the smaller ones that I'm going to end up doing. And I do have a video coming up on more diamond paintings that I actually have purchased. So stay tuned for that because I did buy a bunch more. Well, I didn't buy a bunch more. I bought one and then I was gifted a couple. So you'll be excited to see those because those are really cute. All right. These I'm going to be using also, I'm going to be using these because there's a bunch of different sizes in here. There's like a huge one, a couple tiny ones, and then some like medium sized ones. I'm going to be using some of these to put the Maj Paj on my diamond paintings because the bristle one, the bristles are coming off. I, you know, whatever it, that happens. Um, so after it dried, I'd noticed a couple of them have it in there and I know that this will soak up some of the Maj Paj, but I really don't mind it. So, um, and then also I'll be letting the kids use these for art projects too. Cause I think that these could do some cool textures and, you know, teaching the kids how to like hold things properly and all that. So yeah, there are eight in a pack. So, I mean, that's great for a dollar for sure. Cause you go to the other stores and these are like three, four dollars, five dollars for a bag, especially for eight of them. So I'll be using those. Now these are nothing special; they're nothing new. But sometimes I leave. I will make a. I will make coffee or a drink or something, and I not like an alcoholic drink. I mean like iced coffee drink or like a tea or something. And then I like. I'm like, oh, I gotta go here, and then I leave the house and I forget my drink, and then I end up throwing it out because it's gross by the time I get home. So I bought these. I thought these were just really pretty, you know, too, like if I have somebody over the house and they make themselves a cup of coffee, they don't end up finishing it or whatever, tea, whatever they're making, and they don't finish it, I can send them home with something. There's only five. Um, I'm really, I like the reusable ones. These are styrofoam, so they're not the best for the environment. But at the same time, um, there's only five. I won't be using these a lot, but I just thought these were really nice. They had a couple different um, styles, but I just, I thought that these would be good to have pick up um, just in case I needed them. Now these I have hauled before. Um, this is a five pack. So these are, or yeah, these are a five pack. So they've upped it one. Uh, they're originally just four, uh, but these are like little bins. Now again, I, these are just for organizing or paints or whatever you want to do with these. Um, but yeah, I figured I could, you can always use more of these, you know, kids want to put stuff in them, carry them around. They are just great to have on hand. I love the color blue. If you couldn't tell, I like the color blue. I have a lot of blue things. Um, my dishes are blue. Um, like the th like everything in my kitchen has got like a blue 
um, more of a Caribbean blue type, like a light like blue. I, I don't, um, so yeah, so I'm a, I like blue. I don't know why. Um, I mean, even my bride's maid's dresses were blue. Like, I just love blue. Um, and I also, um, Italian ice. So I bought two boxes of these. My husband wanted some so bad before I was going to film, so I told him to throw some in the freezer. So I just have this one. They have two different kinds of the Italian ice. Um, these are the authentic flavors, and then they have another one, which are different flavors. I don't really know the difference between authentic and not authentic. I mean they're just lemon ice I don't know I mean I thought lemon was just the the authentic lemon ice that you had all the time um, but yeah so these are really good they're not bad for you and there's there's only six in this one so the airhead one that I had done um, in the last haul was a little bit better of a deal but they eat them so fast and only 60 calories so yeah I mean I think these are great my son likes them too and they're they're small so they're not horrible but yeah there's cherry berry lemon blue raspberry and strawberry so yeah if you want to give those a try definitely do it they're good all right and then I have this cute my husband actually picked this out he was he's like oh look at this this is cute and he's not really like that type to do that stuff so I thought that that was a cute idea. I mean, they always have so many new ones, but yeah, these are cute Mickey Minnie, you know, great coloring books. I mean, we, I mean, me and, between me and Lisa, we have all these coloring books, but like, again, like when you have kids and, you know, they're getting crazy, you say the word color and they're all about it. At least my son is, I know. And then I did buy this happy birthday sign. Now listen, I don't need it. I'm not using this for my son's birthday. But hey, you never know. It could be somebody's birthday and you forget or it's somebody's birthday and they're like, hey, I'm not doing anything. You want to do something? Have them over. Put up this sign. So I'll be reusing this, you know, like, you know, even for like my husband's birthday or the date of my son's birthday, I might throw this up just to have it. Um... So I have this, and it's just like the little emoji one, but I thought that was super cute. You can, you can see what it it's, looks like there. But these are reusable ones, so just to keep it for a dollar, I thought that that was really cute. So I'm just going to keep that. Now this, um, my son was with me, and this, I had to take it out of the packaging, so, because he wanted it out. But this is just for the pool. It's like a frisbee you just throw up, but it's, it's like a spongy material, so it'll soak it up. So it's also good, too, like if you're just playing outside, and it's really, really hot, and you just kind of want to fling the water around a little bit to kind of dunk this in some cold water, and then just fling it around. But it's so light, and like, um, and it's super cute as a shark. They had a couple different ones, but he he was going baby shark, baby shark. So that's why he get this. That's why we got this one. But I think this is super cute, um, even if it only lasts the summer. No big deal. Um, and then I found these cute little monster stickers. Oh my god! Now let me tell you again. My son loves coloring and stickers. I have stickers all over my house. People are like, oh no, it's on the rug. They're on the couch. They come right off. But listen, I don't care. It's not that big of a deal. If I if I if I was so worried about my house looking perfect all the time, I'd drive myself crazy. But I thought these were just so cute. Look at them. They're just adorable. So I was like, oh, these are cute. I have to get them for a dollar. You know, you never know what you could use them for. So this I thought was really interesting, and there was only a couple of them. So this is an interactive book booklet. So what you do is you download the app down here. Um, and it ha it's, it's for Apple and Google Play. You can use it on, so I'm assuming you would just scan this. You scan the barcode right there, and um, it interacts with your iPad or um, anything, or um, your tablet or whatever. But it does, it comes with stickers. Like, this is, this thing was so cool. I, I grabbed it right away. Um, but see how you've got, like, all your, so you've got stickers in here. And then um, it shows you where to put the stickers. But what you do is you, when you download it, you can color it in on your iPad. What? This is so cool. Like, I didn't, I've never had anything this cool when I was growing up. So basically, and you can share it. So it's, um, so you download the app. The app is Zip It. Um, let me see. So the app is called Zip It. And um, what you're going to do is, oh no, oh my god, I'm so wrong. Okay, so this is not what, I was wrong, I was wrong, I'm so wrong. Let me, ref, let me fix this. Okay, so what you're going to do is you put the stickers on, you color it. 
So you color in the page and add the magical stickers is what they call it. This thing is cool. You have to go get one. Open the Zip It Creative app and watch your artwork come to life. So what it does is you, you look at the picture and what the picture does is it makes it like a living picture and it moves around and does stuff. Get creative by adding new virtual stickers, filters, and frames so you can add on to it in the app. Um, have fun and share your creations with everyone. This is great, guys. I would go, if you can find these, go pick this up. This one is a huge find. This one's a massive find. Um, yeah, I really like, this is so cool. Like, look at it. Look at all these different pages. I mean, this this is great. I would definitely recommend this. So, yeah. It's really cool. It's so cool. This is great. Look at all these pictures. And then you get, you know, you can color on it. Yeah, these are great. This is so much fun. So definitely look this up. Um, I'm sure this is not a dollar store thing. Um, I It doesn't have a price on it, but I'm assuming that normally this would be more than, something like this would be more than a dollar. Yeah, but they kind of like explained to you how it works that here and then also on the back. So this is something great and fun for all kids. It does say five and up, but my son will love this. So um, definitely something to look up. Like I said, it is called Zip It Creativity. Um, they did have a, they had a different one too, but I found the monster one and I thought that was great. Um, and this, I would have walked right by it because I thought it was just a coloring book at first. And then I was like, wait a minute, it has a Google thing and an Apple thing. I'm like, what is this? Definitely a great find. Definitely something you would want to pick up and have for your kids. Um, definitely something on the iPad that is not just watching junk or whatever. Um, definitely interactive. Something great, great, great for a road trip that we will be taking. So I will probably bring this on the road trip. Um, and then this I found for Father's Day. Look at how cute this is. They had a couple different ones, but my husband does a lot of handiwork. Um, that's what he does for work, basically. So um, I thought this was really cute. So this will be, I'll put his gift, whatever it is. I don't know yet. Um, in there. And then these are, um, what is this? Oh, so basically they're pop-up things that comes with, I can feel the markers in here. So they're pop up, they're like um, cardboard pop out things. So like if you would, you know, you can set them places. So yeah, so they stand up, so you color them and then you can stand them up and you can display them. I thought that was really cute. So we have the Paw Patrol, I thought that was great. And then here's another Paw Patrol thing that I got, which is Sky, one of those other expanding um, towels that we have a million of, but like my son loves to watch them. They're fun if we have people over, they like little other little kids, they like to use them. So I thought that was cute to have that. Um, and then also with the brushes that I got too, I got, remember these little trays when you were a kid, you know, you put all the colors in here and then you paint, you know, you, you dip your thing in there and paint. So there's six of them in here for a dollar. I thought that was a great deal. So, and these, again, these are easy to just rinse right off and throw wherever you, you want to put them. So I got these, and like I said, six are great because you never know if you lose one or if you have more kids over, all that stuff. You know how kids are. So, and then here is the bag again. Great bag, guys. Like, these bags are so great, so cute. Like I said, if you see them, grab them because let me tell you, these, the two that I got were the only two left, so I'm not the only one thinking that um, because I've seen those bags, and I've always been like, mm, I don't really like that one. Mm, I don't really need that one, but the Toy Story ones were great. But yeah, so that is my second part of my haul. So thank you guys for watching this in two separate videos because I just did not want to put it in one. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have a great day. Enjoy. Hope the weather is great where you are. It's getting better. It's getting warmer here. Um, but yeah, so please don't forget to like and subscribe if you like these videos. Um, we have some more fun videos coming up for you guys. You know, more DIYs and more food videos and... We just have lots of stuff planned. And then at the end of June, we're going to Hershey. So we might have some packing videos for you guys um, with some packing tips that we have. We'll definitely be showing you a little bit of our vacation also. Um, but yeah, so have a great rest of your day. And also don't forget to hit that bell notification so you are aware of every time we post a video for you guys. All right, have a great rest of your day. Enjoy and we'll see you guys soon. Bye.